So this is a wax moth larvae that I'm offering to the chameleon and I've dusted it with calcium as well because um, it's always good to give them extra calcium in their diet, um, particularly if they're captive bred. And you'll see he's spotted it now. He's got special eyes that can look both behind and in front at the same time, often independently of each other. So one eye can be looking one way and the other the other way. And um, they've got these extra long tongues that they can actually put out very, very fast. He's going to do that just in a second. There we go. And chameleons require extra light and heat, like a lot of lizards um, kept in captivity, um, particularly as these come from um, Yemen. Um, they're veiled chameleons, and this is a male, so he will have some very, very lovely colours when he grows up. And at the moment, he's still very, very small. As you can see, that's my my first index finger. And the eyes that they have are both good for predators, for catching things, for judging distance, and also for um, prey, because obviously they can check behind them. Um, and as you probably know, they're very good at camouflaging although their camouflage tends to be colours determined by mood rather than by what they're standing on. And as you can see there, they've got those special feet just for um, clinging on and they've got a very special way of moving as well so that they look a bit like leaves or twigs blowing in the wind.